can see the frustration there for Nomi. It wasn't a bad run. She had a touch, but the time was okay. But the, the spin there, a bold move. Uh, but unfortunately, she couldn't pull it off Naomi Fox. So she will really struggle to make it to the final. Now, Victoria Dobrotoska from Ukraine. Uh, very low-key last week in Augsburg. We certainly didn't see the best of her, I don't think, in Germany. So she'll be out today to try and uh, put down a good run. Of course, uh, the Ukrainians, I, I mention it every time we have a Ukrainian paddler on the screen, uh, on the water, just what they've had to deal with to, to try and stay focused and to keep competing at the top level. It's been so hard for all of them. For her, Victoria Us, there's a couple of the men in, in the sprint canoe, there's athletes there, they're trying to uh, compete still, trying to stay focused on hopefully getting to Paris next year. But as Victoria Us said to me the other day, your mood for the day depends a lot on what is the first news item you hear every morning. And of course, they wake up in the morning, they look at their phones, they check the news, and that can determine your mood for the day because there's a lot of stuff happening at home, which is, oh, oops. Might as well bang both ends of the, the, uh, the canoe into the wall. So this is not a bad time, it's a little bit slow, she's got a gate touch, but nobody yet has really had a clean run through here. Oh, that's quite good. She's done well. She's actually, now there is the difference. If you can put that together on that gate combination, you are going to pick up a lot of time. And Victoria Dobrotoska has gone from being more than five seconds down to only being 0.3 of